Hey guys, J Dog here. And it Observer. <clears throat> Welcome back to Let's Play Splatter House. Ew. Oh, yep. We're at the Carnival of Horror or whatever the hell it's called. I didn't look like the fucking white part on the body. Why? Why is a big question for this game. <laughs> okay, considering I don't actually have all of the pictures I thought I had, I'm going to be doing a lot more uh, scoping of the levels. Which kind of sucks, considering I can't see shit on my screen. Of course, then again, why would you want to see shit? <laughs> Shit's in a very pretty sight. And oh god! Oh, it's scary! No, not really. It's not. Okay, well, I'll just kill these bitches. You know, every fight is actually, um... This game's like an RPG in a sense, because every enemy you fight is another handful of experience for you. Gotcha, bitch. <laughs> Indeed. What do you mean by that dog? What do you mean by what? RPG. You know like you get experience by defeating enemies in RPGs? Hmm. It's that's a major way you get it in this game. You need blood to experience and the only way to get blood is to kill enemies. <laughs> and actually the amount or the combo you do on the enemy before you kill him does have an effect on how much blood you get from them. I'm not sure what the formula is for that, but it's not bad. And it's not to like God of War standards, but oh shit! <laughs> nice. <laughs> Master. When I got to this bar, the fire really pissed me off. How could it not? I think the only one of the only enemies that's more annoying than these fire-breathing clowns are those Blue weird. Guys. <laughs> what ones? The blue thing. The little normal brittle enemy, but the blue. Oh yeah, those guys are annoying too. But I was gonna say like the frog guys that spit acid. We'll be seeing those later. Hate those guys. <laughs> and then the anus, the anus frog. <laughs> Let's not get into that right now. I don't know if I'll be able to even show that on this. No. You can't show that on TV. Working on it. Well, I think it's the same rules as Deviant, right? Boobies are okay, but penis, no. It has to be. It has to be what? Like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Twist. <gasps> Just gotta yell about everything, don't you, Rick? Let me through. <laughs> Did that actually hurt you? <laughs> I guess so. What balls? Balls, indeed. Balls to you? Balls to the walls. Oh look, another one of these fuckers. No. Oh shit! <laughs> that actually surprised me a little bit. No, I don't understand what's up with the Cyclops, the glasses. Me either. That looks terrified. Maybe they're hinting at, like, this horror house. Horror house, not whorehouse. It's so scary that it even scares monsters. 
I don't know. Pricks. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Oh well. I'll just kill him in a hurry then. You can actually turn this off if you want to, but you know, it's a quick and easy way to kill enemies because you don't really flinch from taking damage. I don't know if you even take damage. Was it good for you? <laughs> Was it good for you? Huh, I can't remember. Okay, you can follow her. There is a picture piece that way, but it's a trap and you have to go through everything all over again. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I got that piece of the picture already. Yeah, because that one time I was trying to tell you don't go that way. See what I mean about like <laughs> That's what I mean when I say that Rick is like he's the epitome of good guys in the world. He did this bad thing like something that's really bad to do in a relationship. And even though he's keeping it a secret from his girl, he's keeping it in mind. And he's well aware that he actually let her down when this happened. And he's going out of his way to make sure it doesn't happen again. I shouldn't say out of his way, but... In a sense, he's showing extreme effort not to... And I can sympathize, because I'm like that. I love how the clowns squeal after. Yeah. It sounds like you're. You know, like clowns wear those honking noses. You know what I mean? Yeah. It sounds like that. It does. <laughs> 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 oh, jeez. Oh, okay. I'm ripping his arm off. <laughs> okay, that fire breathing is pissing me off. A lot. That's how much. Come here, fucker. One of my favorite, like, lines the mask has when you're finishing an enemy off is... When you're going to rip their arms off, and the mask just says, Pain! <laughs> it's like just one word, but it illustrates what's going on so well that it's hilarious. I love what Rick does to get him to turn around so he can rip our arms off. It's just one heavy punch in the face and they spin around. Like that. <laughs> That's the one I was talking about. For anyone who doesn't know already. It turns out this game is actually really popular because you can still buy it new for like 20 bucks. Okay, these are the fuckers that spit acid. They are annoying as hell. Mm. They go underground and then they jump up and they spit acid at you. There goes one underground. Oh, there goes one spitting acid. 